Hello Sapphire and in this video you are going to learn this 3D money explosion effect. This tutorial is not for money explosion. In fact by end of this tutorial you will be able to use this technique in your own unique way. Here's exactly how to do it step by step. Import your PNG, go to layer menu and click on auto trace. You can copy my settings or tweak them according to your liking. Hit ok. Now create a solid layer. Go to effects and preset and search for element. Apply it to your layer, go to custom layers, custom text and mask, change path 1 to auto trace layer, go to custom texture map, change layer 1 to your PNG, now go to scene setup and click on extrude. Under extrusion model select bevel 1, as you can see the bevel is really thick, go to bevel and make extrude value 0 to make it flat, like this. Now go to textures, diffuse and load your texture. In my case the PNG is not aligned with the model so we will play around with UV repeat and UV offset to align it perfectly. Like this. Now click OK. You can hide those layers. Go to group 1, particle replicator and make the particle count to 20 for now. Now we will increase the Z position like this. Now go to replicator effects, scatter and increase the scatter value. Play around with X and Y scatter. You can also play around with Z scatter to add more depth. Now we will go to particle look, go to particle rotation. Now hold alt on your keyboard and click on rotation random stopwatch. Here we will use this simple expression time multiply by 50. You can also increase or decrease this value according to your liking. Now we will go to deform, go to bend, enable it, make bend direction to 90 and play around with bend angle according to your liking. Now we will go to twist, enable it and increase phase z value according to your liking. As you can see we are almost there, now we are going to add few keyframes to make the explosion effect. Go to particle replicator, scatter, keyframe all these, press U on your keyboard and drag these keyframes forward according to your liking. Now at start of the clip we will make all these values to 0 like this and we are also going to keyframe position Z and decrease the value like this. Now select all these keyframes, press F9 on your keyboard, go to graph editor and make a graph like this. As you can see we got the explosion effect, now you can add deep blow on it or add any effect to make it yours. So this is for the explosion effect, now what we can do is delete these keyframe, we can also make the money rainfall. Just increase the z position like this, we can also increase particle count and increase scatter values like this. Now we will add keyframe for position xy, drag the values above and to end of your video, drag them down, like this. As you can see we got the pretty cool money rain effect. You can also play around according to your liking and make it yours. And that's it for today's video, hope you learned something new. If you want to learn more cool stuff like this, subscribe, hit the bell icon and I'll see you in the next one.